Hi guys, in this video we will discuss topographic and anatomy of heart starting with your surfaces and borders. The heart has 5 surfaces and 4 borders. Surfaces are formed by different internal divisions of the heart. The surfaces are namely anterior, posterior, inferior and left and right pulmonary. Now the surface you are seeing labeled 1 is your anterior or sternocostal surface and it is composed of your light ventricle. The surface you are seeing label 2 is your posterior surface or also called as base and it is composed of your left atrium. Now the third uh, surface that is you are seeing labeled as third is your inferior or diaphragmatical surface composed of your left ventricle. 4 and 5 are your right and left pulmonary respectively and are composed of your right atrium and left ventricle respectively. Now as I told you that there are four borders and the four borders actually separate the surfaces from the heart. The four borders are your right border, left border, upper border and your uh, inferior border. Now upper border is also known as superior border and lower border is also known as, known as your inferior border. Now right border is your right atrium and inferior border is your left ventricle and right ventricle. Superior border is your right atrium and left atrium and the great vessels that you are seeing right here. The left border is your left ventricle and some of the right atrium. Now moving on to the circles of hearts. So there are grooves on the surface of heart and these grooves are known as your sulci. Now the there are two main sulci are there and these are your atrioventricular and interventricular circles. Now atrioventricular circles is also known as your coronary circles and, and it runs transversely around the heart and represents your uh, the wall dividing the atria from the ventricles. It contains your right coronary artery that is why it is known as your coronary sulcus. Now the second sulcus is your interventricular sulcus and these uh, interventricular sulcus are your anterior and posterior interventricular sulci and they are found running vertically on their respective sides uh, of the heart and they represent the wall separating the ventricles. Now there are two sinuses on heart. The oblique pericardial sinus and transverse pericard pericardial sinus. Now the oblique pericardial sinus is a cul-de-sac meaning that is a blind ending and it is located on the posterior surface of heart. Now the transverse pericardial sinus is found superiorly on the heart and it is used in coronary artery bypass grafting. So that is it for this video. I hope you liked it and learned something from it and thanks for watching.